So this is a project that came out of uh, the Greater Concord Chamber of Commerce's Creative Concord Committee. And we have been doing quite a bit of public art in downtown Concord, uh, a sculpture program that is leased pieces of art, and we've been doing that in partnership with the City of Concord. The committee thought that it would be a great idea to do something up on the heights, and so we gave it a lot of thought, and we were fortunate to get to know Karen Kelly, a local muralist, who facilitates these types of projects um, all over the world. So she's right here in our own backyard. I'm Karen Kelly, and I live here in Concord, and I am I am facilitating this uh, community mural that we're doing here for the community of the Heights in Concord, New Hampshire. So this is a community mural. So about, I don't know, two or three weeks ago, we had a meeting where we tried to get as many community members together as possible um, to decide what the design of the mural should be. What, what is it about community here in the Heights that speaks to people, what's important to them, and so that's how we came about with the design that we have. And uh, here we are today painting this piece that was designed by people up on the Heights neighborhood that came together and gave input on all kinds of design ideas and then some local artists came together and turned those ideas into a sketching. So today we're having people from all over the community come up and paint the mural and we're hoping to get this done between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. today and have it up at Arnie's place uh, for the long run. The Little Pirate Guy is um, representative of the title of the Heights back in 1860. It's Burglar's Island. So they would go down, the few people that lived here would go down to the city, rob them and come back because they knew they wouldn't be followed because there was no road here then. Well, I would just like to say that this is done through a uh, grant from the New Hampshire Charitable Foundation. And obviously the people of Arnie's have been super great. Um, Home Depot donated all the paint. Um, a and B Lumber donated a lot of the work of putting this panel up. I, I went to school for fine art and I'm a local muralist and I got in touch with Karen about doing this community event and here we are on the paint day. Hi, uh, my name is Gail Matson. I'm the Ward 8 City Councilor for the Heights up on this side of the street on Loudon Road and i um, very pleased to be here today and be part of the painting for this mural. Pretty happy to see that we're having certain um, just attention brought to the Heights and so that people can see how much we uh, do care about our community and how much people can be involved and be a part of it. You know, we've been doing a fair amount of public art and trying to advance the creative economy in Concord through public art projects. Um, but those have really been focused in the downtown. So we wanted to expand to other neighborhoods in Concord and the Heights came to mind. You know, we're going to keep doing murals and this is, I think, is a big step for exterior work in Concord where I think we're lacking a little bit in that. And I'm hoping to have more of that come to life, you know, come spring and summer and the years to come. It's a neighborhood project and um, it's, it's just very positive. It brings people together to do something really cool in this particular neighborhood. Maybe sometime in the future we'll be able to look at Pennacook as another location for a different art project, but we'd love to expand beyond the downtown into the Heights and into Pennacook.